You're an event professional and you're looking to learn pipe and drape, but perhaps maybe you just don't know where to start or you're getting all of the wrong resources from different designers, different groups, and you're just getting frustrated at this point. If that is so, hold tight, because I have just the thing for you. Yep, so with the good part about building on your third layer, you already know this is your center. So you can have them meet up in your center, but since you want the middle of your design to show, you want to open it up, right? Now you're building off of what you already built. So you could take this color, line it up with, you get what I'm saying? So it's kind of like cheating, but it's the easy way. <laughs> it's the easy way, right? So you'll just keep moving that over. And then you make sure that that is lined up right where they meet. That way you know that this is even, and that way you know that this is even. <laughs> All right, so let me show you. You want to put it up here, right? Pretty much going directly in front of your pole. Only thing you're going or doing is going straight up. Don't think about it, just go straight up. Tie it like a loaf of bread. Look what you had up there. Give it one. Two, mm -hmm. then you stick it through the, you take one, I call them bunny ears. You take oh, yeah. one of your bunny ears, give it a twist and a twist. That's it, nothing more. But this, you don't have to do this because you're using a, per, okay. absolutely. Now see how that just, that looks like something. I don't know what that looks like. I like precious did it. <laughs> yeah, I wanna see you do this one. Now you wanna make sure, tighten this up. There you go. Then just go directly in front of your pole. Up, up, drop it. Up, up, directly touch your pole. Oh, there we go. Up, 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 up. Up, 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 up. Don't do that. Just keep going, just perfect. Now don't go around this pole, go over top. There you go. That's how you get a, a balance. The first time when, I, when he did it, I was like, that look good. But then a good thing, our eyes sometimes it do what it want to do. It see what it want to see. And sometimes it ain't the truth. <laughs> I'm just saying it ain't. So the easiest way to determine that is one, take a picture. If you by yourself, take a picture because the phone, you can see. But the, what I do, you see these beams on the ceiling? I will take things that's parallel to what I'm trying to do. And the line, I'll line it up with those beams. Like, oh, that's a little, you get what I'm saying? That's, I'll start using symmetrical stuff. Like, it looked straight to me but then I looked at the beams I say no nah, like he off three inches so use things like that if you're in wherever you are y'all got those like these kind of grids I always try and make sure that that shows that my backdrop is even just use whatever you got used in the roof got it okay what we got so you you got you guys are uh waiting on me that's pretty I got you this looks good though I like that so only thing I would say is probably need to be tightened on that side, but I like that. And this probably just need to be a little tighter so it doesn't, I'm going to put it back here so it doesn't fall forward. I'm going to do it and show you what I'm doing. I'm actually tying this to the back. Thank you so much. And I really want you to be on the lookout for the Posh Academy's draping workshops because we're coming to a city near you. And I hope to see you on the inside.